What's up, guys? This is uh, Mr. Pyrofiend. I got Mr. Marauder here with me. What's up, everybody? And uh, we're going to do some gameplay from Carbon, some team deathmatch, trying to win them uh, elite ops, most kills in team deathmatch. Which is Vengeful Beast, I believe. Yeah, Vengeful Beast, you know, three hours worth of fucking pooping on kids as much as possible. Just run around, get as many kills as you possibly can within the three hours. Yeah, so preferably you would like an MP7, something small, and of course the fucking always reliable cool FMGs because they're what the popular kids like to use. But all the good kids use. Yeah, all the pros are using them, it's true. I mean, you can't deny their pinpoint accuracy headshots from 360 degrees around the body, shooting around corners through trucks and underneath the map. It's like every bullet somehow is magically connected to someone's forehead. It's true. It's like it has a preset destination. Whether you shoot it off the map, under the floor, it's going to fucking get a dome shot 100% of the time. This is... this it's, is it's, a, it's the truth. It's the truth. I mean, there's been studies done. I don't know, like, exactly what they were done, but they were done. They were done, in fact. And, uh, that perfect, perfect examples. Watch this. Watch this kill coming up right here. Should I have gotten that? That's debatable. But the point is I got it, and he is sorry for it. So that's how the FMGs work right there. And, you know, when you're running these competitions, you, you want to use kill streaks that you don't really have to fucking, you know, you don't want to use an AC-130. You need something that's going to work for itself, get you a quick kill, and then you can move on. Something like TAC Helicopter, AH-6 Overwatch would have been nice. Yeah. And you see here, I call my I call my helicopter in, and before it goes away, I already have another one to call in. You'll see it in the video. You just watch. You just keep watching. Going on a nice little streak here, Look Pyro. This guy, did you see that guy? That he, guy has no he idea. He failed horribly. Like he should just punch himself in the uterus a hundred times. <laughs> You're getting a little campy here, aren't you, Pyro? Oh uh, well, you know, I'm just trying to preserve my life. I don't know what for, but that's what, that's what the plan was. Well, you make up for the campiness with a nice triple kill here. Oh yeah. Triple kills all day long, that's what we do. See, I have my second attack helicopter. I'm just waiting around, you know, chilling, trying not to get murdered by dual FMGs. You know how it goes. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but back to the gameplay. Oh, yes. So, what, what you, you haven't died yet, have you? Um, I don't believe so. So, you're on a nice kill streak. I'm on a decent little kill Running streak. Running out of ammo, gotta resort to the knife. Gotta resort to the knife, always. All good kids always have the knife on tactical. Just, that's how we roll. <clears throat> Finally, get my attack helicopter called in, you know, get some more heads chopped up with it. Actually, didn't quite get it called in. Oh, is that my, what was that, my. Yeah, your UAV. UAV? Yeah, well. That always helps. Nice little feature they added so you can <laughs> <laughs> switch between your kill streak. Oh yeah. Uh, the, the UAV is the good kid's number one weapon of destruction. It is. Look at this guy. He got turned on in such a way that his mind has still not received data. Thank you. He's sort dead out. Displaced his shin bone there a little bit. Yeah, he's, he's, he's not in very good mood right now. He may or may not be hanging in this closet. And these guys did not even have a chance. They had no clue. They were too busy shooting uh, P90s at a helicopter, which is always tactic number one for taking down air support. As Shoot you, at it with a submachine gun. Yes. It works every time. It always does. And More I, headshots, I, I see. I yanked that kill. I kind of felt bad about it, but not really. That kid wasn't going to get it anyway. He was probably about to step on a grenade or something. And here I thought I was working it, and you know that, that third guy, they always get you, man. Getting some mad kill streaks going. Yeah, you gotta keep them rolling. You gotta always keep moving. When you're playing these, you just gotta keep moving. You can't forget it's all about the kills in this. Yeah, except for when that bastard got a sniper rifle. Except for when you die. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, another good feature is the portable radar. You, know, you notice how I just throw it down anywhere, all willy nilly like. It doesn't matter where it lands, as long as it works. It helps everybody. It does. It helps everybody. You know, that's that's teamwork right that there. That is teamwork. I might be finest. going for kills for myself, but I'm still thinking about the team. You know, I got the UAV out, helicopter. That helps everybody. You're a real good guy, Pyro. I am. A, a, probably one of the best. I'm just throwing that out there. I would agree. And uh, got a nice little camper kill there. That's always that always makes your heart warm when you kill a camper. Yeah. Got what was coming for him. Oh yeah, he did. He, he knew he was about to be shot in the back. He just didn't know it yet. Well, this game's starting to wrap up here. Let's yeah. see. 
You got a 75 to 30 something or other. Pretty good gameplay, I believe. Yeah, that's keeping on in under four minutes, five minutes, something like that. Gotta keep it quick. Hit this guy with his fresh as hell last kill. So 35 kills, not bad. Not not too bad, you know. Just trying to get them kills up, man. That's all it's up about, for real. Mr. Pyrofina, Mr. Marauder. We're out. Later, bitches.